all right what's up guys welcome back to another amazing video thank you so much for watching on this video i'm gonna be talking about titan x just a few things that i think you should be informed about first i hope you guys are having an amazing weekend be safe safe out there and enjoy it with your family friends and pets the token price right now is five zeros and a two five nine three nothing too big on the prices wise like we've been hovering around this range for give or take a few days now and it looks like the 1334 are starting to separate from each other that's something that i'm watching very closely at least this is under the four hour charting so keep that in mind once they start separating away from each other typically what that usually means is that we could see another small drop like whenever i pull back the the 1334 all the way to the previous over here past you know weeks or so you would see like gaps like this tend to make it drop pretty heavy into the price and the closer they are like right here usually means not always but some some of the instances is like the candlesticks are close to each other with the 1334 but once they start getting separate from each other typically means a drop is coming so be cautious out there in case you do, do want to dca this is one of them up huge opportunities um there uh, i don't know how much i can say but all i want to let you guys know is that i would suggest loading up on titan x for the future like it will be very important and and wise to have liquid titan x in your portfolio for stuff that comes out that's all i can say so looking forward for the future for titan x let me know if you're excited for the future the hyper the burning the payouts click the like button subscribe thank you all new subscribers that are coming out through here a lot of you guys enjoyed the other video in which i informed you about free money from the airdrops which i can leave it down below in the description as well again there's a bunch of free money out there that some of them are already claimable other ones are you got to do small little tasks in which you can get, you know, more free money in the future once the token drops. But there's airdrops everywhere, pretty much almost every single time. So do your research. I'll leave it down below in the description. A lot of you guys enjoyed that. So hopefully you do have some funds or some coins somewhere in the Solana network or Ethereum network in which you can put that money into the, uh, Titan X and start up some miners. I want to point out one tweet that is actually doing really, really good. and. I think a lot of you guys agree with it. Now, looking into here, I sent out this tweet earlier today, and I said, imagine a project that launches and it does. they do a massive airdrop. In the year 2024, I do expect a lot of airdrops to be coming out in the crypto space just to get that hype coming up right before the bull run. And this is what I said, claiming cost to be able to claim that airdrop is going to be Titan X, and that Titan X will be burned. Then what if you, they also implement a type of tokenomics in which that airdrop, the amount of coins are going to be getting increases every day or maybe every hour or something, but the coins increase, but so will the fee of Titan X in order for you to be able to claim. So that's a pretty cool idea that I had. I just sent it out there and it's actually doing really good. Like it's catching eyes of a lot of the Titan X community. Let me know those of you that, you know, in case you're new, go follow me on Twitter. It's Crypto Audit King. The link's going to be down below in the description. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Is this a good idea? Maybe some of you guys, you know, maybe you guys know somebody that can make this happen. I just put it out there. I randomly thought about it. And I just think I just think it's a pretty dope idea and co uh, concept in which it will benefit Titan X overall. You know, we're gonna need a lot of this these coins in the future. Like, think about that. That's just one idea for one DAP. Like, it's crazy, and we only have seven point seven four percent liquid for anybody and everybody to be able to do anything with it. It's gonna drop once Hyper comes out. You know, it's gonna be required like many things out there that dApps could be able to use for meme coins the future looks bright and i do see a lot of wor worried people about the supply i do see people also mentioning that the amount of eth required to keep this price stable is about i think i saw 500 to 600 eth a day and right now, Titan X is generating about 400 to 450 ETH, somewhere around. The, the number's a little bit, you know, 
not accurate enough, not exact, but it's a rough estimate of about 400 to 450 ETH a day. So, you know, in order to keep this price hovering around there, of course, we need more ETH to be coming in than what is required. So if you do the math right, the prices tend to do maybe a little drop, maybe. But then again, what's coming up into the future could benefit us big time, like huge. What a lot of people also don't put into consideration is the payouts, like even the 90 day payouts, which is literally 20 days away, 19 days away, whatever it is, this money is going to be sent out to stakers. And you got to put in, and in, in, you got to also think how much of that money is going to be put back into miners. How many of these guys are going to go and buy the token? That's going to create a lot of buy pressure. It's going to be that help that we need for us. So I think. Even though the chart is, is kind of on its way down, because look at that 1334 curling downward, it's separating from each other. Even though I see this maybe dropping, you know, another 5%, give or take, the overall long term for Tyne X, it's going to benefit us being, we're still OG, so we are still super early into this. And now it's the point to where short term, miners are very high risk maybe not even profitable maybe you're gonna break even give or take a little bit of a loss but long term max term especially is with them that are going to be benefiting the most like crazy there is people out there doing 20 days and 30 days and even if it's a 30 percent loss on the minor profitability profitability then they are just simply doing it because of speculation of hyper. They're doing it for like high, high risk for a high reward. But I wouldn't recommend that in my opinion. You know, if, if you want to do that, that's totally up to you. It's your funds. It's your money. You make that decision. I can't decide it for you. I'm just putting out there my own personal thought, my opinion, what I'm seeing on the chart, what I'm seeing based off of the stats coming out from the uh, Ethereum coming in and the Ethereum coming out. We got to keep that in mind as well. It's where Titan X is growing, man. It really is. More and more people are eyeing this than ever before, both on YouTube, Twitter, especially using the right hashtags and everything. It's starting to trigger a lot of new viewers, which means they're going to bring over a lot of fresh Ethereum into us, into the token, and it's going to create a lot more hype. So looking forward to it, man. I'm not very too much worried about this. I have, um, I have some uh, miners on here for a 33 day and a 35 days and stuff like that just tests right and i am up about 100 percent roi if the price stays constant around here i'm fi almost 50 percent done with that if it comes out good then i'm probably just gonna re compound and probably just do max mints throughout the whole entire time period i think it's like 3k or so that's going to be coming out on the 24th give or take 20 yeah 24th and 26th of this month and depending on what i see depending on the technical analysis will determine what i'm going to do whether it be you know staking max or getting more miners or holding some liquid tying x in case something happens right so that's just my own um experience sorry that's my over here she's about to cry um so i'm gonna go take my out to walk and just chill so come here baby those of you that are new to the channel this is maya this is my pet poodle She's freaking amazing. We just came back from the vet, by the way. She had a pink eye. Can you believe that? Um, but she is two and a half years old. And I hope you guys um, end up loving Maya as much as I do. So, guys, thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow in the next video. Take it easy. I'm out. Peace.